Hi, I'm Alex Buckman for DrillingContractor.org here at the IADC Advanced Rig Technology Conference in Austin. We're meeting with Richard Manning of NOV's Well Site Services. Thank you for taking time to speak with us, Mr. Manning. Good afternoon. Uh, during your presentation, you discussed uh, the NOV's new Sabre Shaker system. Why is the Sabre system different from shakers that are currently on the market? Um, traditional shakers rely on a mechanical means to increase throughput capacity by increasing the g-force. Um, the Sabre works in a very different way by relying on fluid head to drive fluid through the screen and not increasing um, the g-force within the basket itself. You mentioned that you were able to get the screen replacement time in the shaker down to 90 seconds. How were you able to accomplish that? Basically the system design, the screens are pneumatically screened, uh, pneumatically clamped so effectively all you have to do is turn the shaker off, switch off the air and pull all the screens. The screen design is such that they all interlink. So when you pull the front screen, the back comes with it. So effectively the whole screen deck is pulled in one go. That is the reason why it's so quick to change the screens. Uh, during your presentation on the, on, this, on the new shaker system, you mentioned that the Sabre was able to achieve significant reductions in LGS uh, so how, was that, how were you able to achieve those results? I guess the simple answer is because of the system's ability to process higher fluid rates, um, we have the, also the ability to screen up much finer, much faster. So effectively we're getting the low gravity solids out a lot quicker than is traditionally seen. Normally, um, if you can't process higher capacity, you're not really running very fine screens. So it's just the ability to screen up faster and finer. You said that this was had been tested in uh, five wells, is that correct? Yes. And, uh, and those were onshore wells? Yes. So how long was your trial period? About 60 days. Oh. And uh, when do you expect, when do you anticipate this uh, system being available to, on the commercial market? It's currently available on the customer market and we are selling these units into uh, the US land market as it is. Uh during your presentation, you talked quite a bit about the Sabre system's ability to be retrofitted, and how is that a key factor for drilling contractors? Given the market conditions that we currently have at the moment, we as a business need to be aware that we have to supply cost-effective cost means to be able to upgrade um, rig equipment quickly, efficiently, and at low cost. The main point of a retrofit is minimal modifications to what is the existing system on the rig. Thank you for taking time to speak with us. Thank you. And thank you for watching our video on drillingcontractor.org.